hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome my name is simmery and today i am giving you guys 10 plus mods for realistic gameplay for the sims 3 so without further ado let's go ahead and hop right into it so the first mod on our list which you guys can see here is called pregnancy interactions more pregnancy interactions which is a really cool mod made by the sweet simmer and it literally just gives more interactions for your sim to um, mess around with when they are pregnant so your sim here can have options to talk to the baby sing to rub belly give kiss so she was already doing that and it's so cute and also there are options for the children as well so you can ask when the due date is so i'm gonna have her daughter come over and ask when she is due okay she's asking when her mother is due now which is so cute and adorable and she said she will be giving birth in 21 hours oh jeez. um but yeah she can ask when the baby is from and just super adorable um interactions <laughs> see she's reluctant to tell the baby or her daughter where the baby's from oh but yes it's super adorable um sometimes awkward interactions can happen but there are a lot of um options you can also show ultrasound pictures here are ultrasound pictures look at how adorable this is y'all and it just adds so much more realism to your game and i do think um this creator got a lot of these um i guess interactions from the sims 4 so it is super adorable um what else can we do okay i'm gonna have her talk to the tummy how adorable you guys but yeah that's the pregnancy interactions mod okay you guys so the next mod i'm going to talk about is called the live streaming mod by twin simming i actually have a lot of mods on this list by them because they are just amazing when it comes to realistic uh, mods but this mod literally allows your sim to live stream so there are um steps that you need to take in order to do that so it says that you need to open up a blog so i'm gonna go ahead and have my sim start a blog with the social networking app so i think social networking does come with um i think university or <laughs> i think so anyways so i'm gonna trick quickly try to get her skill up so that she can start a blog because you need the social networking skill okay now that my sim has the social networking skill i'm gonna go ahead and blog app just so she can start a little blog or whatever okay we are starting a new blog let's make a post just to do it and she has that now so it does say that we can go ahead and start live streaming so let's go to the computer and it shows the option to live stream and this mod actually goes really well with another mod that pretty much goes with this so it's called the video game skill mod but first I'm gonna have her live stream and then I will show you guys the video game skill mod in a second all right yeah so now she is streaming and it says that sims can stream for two hours four hours six hours or indefinitely and it raises the social networking skill and the video game skill um and yeah there's just a bunch of like tunings and options and things like that that go along with it that i'm not gonna get all into so that brings me into the next mod which is the video game level up skill which goes really well with this live streaming skill this one's also made by twin simming so as you guys can see on the computer there are um if i can find it oh it says play computer game and there's so many options for video games 
and there's different um, level skills that you can get pretty much like any other skill and it comes with other um, options obviously you're going to need university with this for it to work but look at this and you can literally see them playing a game like I, is this the sims that came with Wii? I don't even know. This is so cool though. But yeah, I totally recommend this mod um, along with the live streaming one because it adds so much more depth and options on what type of sim you can have. You can have a really nerdy sim or like a popular Twitch streaming sim. I don't know. It's just so cool. Okay, the next mod I want to talk about really quickly, which I can't really show you guys. I'll show like a picture of the thumbnail and I have talked about this mod before, but it's called the No Mutant Hair or Eyes mod, which is by Kitty Carey. And this mod literally just makes it so that your Sims offspring doesn't have like random eye colors or hair colors that's not from anybody in the family tree i know how annoying it is if you both of your sims have like a blonde hair nobody in their family tree has black hair but somehow some way a sim will come out with black hair like stuff like that kind of takes away from the realism and this mod really helps stick to a more realistic gameplay style in terms of families because the genetics will be passed down more realistically instead of just really random stuff happening all the time okay so the next realistic gameplay mod that i'm going to recommend is called the one with nature mod by S sphere fish which basically just gives you a bunch of interactions with nature that i just think add a lot of realism to your game so all you do is click on the floor or ground outside and it gives you options like pee here sleep here relax here and you can also manage sleeping spots this is really good if you're doing like a rags to riches or something like that so you can also do sponge baths outside so i'm gonna first show you guys what a sponge bath looks like and then we can do the ground interactions so uh, let's go ahead and see her do that but this mod is super cool if you have a really like nature sim if you have like a sim that is homeless i guess that you have like a homeless um storyline for rags to riches runaway teen any of that would definitely help with uh using this mod so as you guys can see she's just giving herself a sponge bath um she has a bad mood let from a cold shower because she is showering in the water um she can also pee like on the ground so let's have her do that really quick come on girly okay so she's peeing on the floor um i'm imagine that would make her smelly um but she can also sleep on the floor too right next to where she fell asleep i mean where she peed she's gonna sleep on the floor and yeah look at that so you can really do a lot with this mod and it definitely adds more realism because in real life you can literally sleep wherever you want <laughs> and you can pee on the ground and do all of these things so i definitely recommend this mod Okay, so the next mod I'm going to show you guys is also from Twin Simming. It's called the Attend University Online mod, which I'm not going to fully show just because it takes a minute to enroll, but I will show you guys how you can get registered. So you want to make sure you have a computer, go to Sims University Online, and click register for Sims University Online, of course and yeah this mod is really really cool if you have like a single parent or like a sim who's like working a job and doesn't want to like go off to university it really adds a lot of depth and storylines with it just by having the option to do this and i just think it's really cool but yeah she is going ahead and registering for online university it's twin simming just has so many realistic mods and it's just so good but yeah it doesn't take too long to do that there we go okay oh no the freaking computer broke 
Okay, I bought a new computer because I did not want to wait. But anyways, so you have to go to back to Sims University online on the computer and you can enroll in all the degrees. Now, I will say that it takes a really long time for your Sim to actually enroll in these degrees. So I definitely recommend setting aside some time and getting that done but i want you guys to explore this mod because it just takes so long and i don't want this video to be forever but yeah totally check out the mod the sims post um from twin simming okay the next mod i'm going to show you guys is called the yoga map mod which is also by twin simming so first you want to go into um build by mode and you can find hobbies and skills and the ma the yoga mats should be here so we have the Zenigan yoga mat we also have the perfect yoga mat so I'm gonna go ahead and place the perfect one down and yeah this mod literally just allows your sims to do yoga which i think is super realistic and cool okay so our little curl is doing the yoga right now and this mod is just super realistic because literally anyone can do yoga in real life and it just adds a new activity for your sims to get into um but yeah this is what it looks like when the kids do it there is more options for adults but our teenager is oh our teenager is here but you know i'm not even gonna bother you guys pretty much can see how it goes and yeah i totally recommend getting this mod okay you guys so the next mod is the gain weight after pregnancy mod so as you guys can see our girl is literally going into labor right now <laughs> and her daughters are freaking out so let's go ahead and have her go to the hospital so she can give birth so it's kind of hard to tell but she has gained a little bit of weight i can already tell just by looking at her she was a lot skinnier before she gained uh gave birth but you know she still looks a reasonable size it's just you know more realistic that women are going to gain weight after they give birth to their baby nobody comes out looking super skinny but if your sim is a snob or athletic they won't gain that much weight so i think it's really realistic because as i said most women end up gaining weight after they give birth anyways and a lot of us have to actually exercise to get that off and i think it's a super realistic mod that adds really a really cool touch to your game okay you guys the next mod that i'm going to be talking about is the mixed feelings about pregnancy mod which was made by liz candor and this mod just lets it so that your um, pregnant sim she can have multiple feelings about her pregnancy because not everyone's going to be happy or sad about pregnancy they're going to be kind of mixed about it for the most part so as you guys can see she's pregnant right now and she is eagerly expecting so it gives her um 20 plus positive mood for from being pregnant there's also a negative mood that, that i saw which i think it was like anxiously expecting or something and yeah it just adds a big lot or a lot of depth for your game okay you guys and the next realistic gameplay mod that i want to talk about is called the sleep on couch mod so it's pretty self-explanatory you're just allowed to sleep on couches now which it adds a lot of you know plots and just small little changes like this can really enhance your game and tell a story in itself being able to sleep on the couch because if you guys know um in the sims 3 you can't sleep on couches you have to s only nap on them so this is really cool okay you guys and the very last mod that i'm going to talk about is called the acne mod by none other than twin simming so pretty much this mod will make it so that your teens and older can get acne now i definitely mainly use this for teenagers just because um 
I think that's just a really popular thing for teenagers to go through, which is having skin breakouts. Now, I have been trying to get my sim to have a breakout um, because if you have the slob and unlucky traits, those are the ones that are more likely to have an acne breakout. But it, even if your sim doesn't have bre breakouts, it adds extra um, options like washing your face to try to avoid getting acne, but when your sim does get acne, it will pop up in their face, and yeah, I think this is super cool. So she did receive a positive moodlet. Oh, let me get rid of that. It says practicing self-care. So yeah, that is the last mod that I am going to talk about. But yeah, you guys, if you enjoyed these mod overviews and these recommendations for realistic gameplay, please go ahead and leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you um, have any questions or concerns, go ahead and leave them down in the comments below. And I hope you all have an amazing day. Bye!